Hello guys, welcome to another video about the DaVinci Resolve iPad app. So, since the iPad app uh, DaVinci Resolve came out, I start editing all my videos on my iPad. I have the 12.9 inch uh, iPad Pro 2022. This is a beast of a machine, edit machine uh, with the M2 chip, so nothing can stop it. But sometimes, as you can see here, the clips uh, can be really uh, crowded and everything can be a bit messy, especially if I want to see everything that is on my timeline at one uh, time. Look at here, I have like uh, seven video tracks right now and uh, this is not very easy for me to see. I can stretch this down, but even so I cannot access all uh, the clip videos that I have on my video at one glare. So what I can do is, if I come here and I select these clips here, I come down, for example, till here, and I open the menu, I can go here and create a new compound clip. This, what we'll do is we'll gather all the clips in just one clip, I can give it a name, okay, and now, look, it's all in just one uh, video track. All the five, six, seven things that I had here are now only on a video clip. Now I can easily play and everything, as you can see here, still running smoothly, but now it's only in one compound clip. And this is really, really good. But now you can ask me, okay, but what if I want to go back and edit something in one of those video clips? Well, it's quite easy. Just come here and you say decompose in place. And look, there they are again all. So you can work in each one of them individually, but you can do even more. So let me just uh, uh, create a compound clip again. So here we have, okay, my compound clip. Let's create it. Now, what if I want to just bring those clips to another timeline? Look, I just here say open in timeline and look at that. They are all here in another timeline so I can work with them with uh, no problem. And here I can do another compound clip and so on and so on. This is just one of the great things of the compound clip. Okay guys, hope you found this video useful. See you at my next video.